Hey guys, I got this, uh, wanted to go over a few things with you today. This is an 06 Dodge Ram, and I wanted to give you guys a quick fix on headlight issues, low beam headlight issues. This is a sweet trick I got. So basically, now in this truck, I've only got one bulb, one bulb's bad. But the issue with this truck is a buddy of mine brought this to me, and he's got, he's always had only one headlight working. Now he had one bad bulb, like I said, so I'll kind of give you a quick show of what I'm talking about. So this headlight works over here, and this is the one that's been working. So this is a good bulb, so if I take this bulb out, and I put it on this socket, it's not going to work. Good bulb, plugged in, it's not working. So he's been replacing this bulb, replacing this bulb. I don't know why he did it so many times. He replaced this bulb so many times that his other side went out and then he had no headlights. And you can see this bulb on his black. This is the bad one. So basically what this issue is, is it's a, like I said, it's an 06 Ram. This is 1500 with a 3.7 liter. So this box is the problem. The driver going to this headlight is bad. So whatever happened, this box, this control module set at one time, it's too much amperage coming from this side. It's gonna just take the circuit down. So what it does, it shuts the driver off to this side. So how do you fix that, shutting the driver off to this side? You don't, you take this, you throw it in the trash and you buy, you spend 800 bucks and you buy a whole new brain right here for the headlights. And that's very expensive just to fix one driver. So what I didn't show you guys is just to make sure, is I went ahead and took my meter and I ohm tested the wires from this line, from this uh, socket to the TIPM, totally integrated power module. I went from this wire, the low side driver to here, made sure the wire was good, it was. I did the low side driver on that side to the TIPM, make sure the wire was good and it was. So I just, I kind of just wanted to make sure there was no wire issue in between here or there. So then, basically what I did is I found my two low side dri driver wires. Now, like I said, this is an 06 again. I have a tan and yellow. It's a, I mean, it's a white wire with a tan stripe right here. That is the driver for the right side low beam. And I have a white wire with a blue stripe here. This is the low side driver for the left side. So basically, and what you can do, if you want to go harder way, I mean, it's not too much harder. It'll only take you a little bit of time. You take the driver wire, which right there, white with the blue stripe. You splice in right here on the back side of this. You run it over to the driver, which is on the back side of this socket. You just splice the two drivers together because one driver in this tip is still good. Most of the time with these tip you'll actually have one driver coming out of the tip -em. That'll always be good. I don't know if it's a fail safe or what, but on mine, is, here's the, the white with tan. Basically, if you're looking at the socket like this, like you just unplugged the bulb, the driver for the low side is usually always on the right side. It's on this side. It'll be this first pin, this first wire coming out. So I jumped them earlier. I took that driver. I jumped it straight over with my jumper leads. I hooked them together, and bam, I had headlights. Um, I'm going to go one step easier on this because if you're going to jump socket to socket, you're going to have to jump, splice in, and you're going to have to run all the way down and probably run a wire down here under the radiator up to the other socket over here. So, I mean, you can do that. That's, that's not bad. I mean, that'll work. And I was kind of cheating just to test it using my jumper lead. But remember, this socket wasn't working. So remember, in here, I have my two low side drivers, and you can find a wiring diagram online for these, which isn't bad. I'm going to splice into here. My low side driver for the right side. This is my low side driver for the left side. I splice them together. And bam. I got headlight now. Because remember, this side was dead. This is the dead driver. This is the $800 driver that you can't fix. So what am I doing? I'm splicing. I'm basically just running my driver for this headlight off my driver for that headlight. I mean, that's all you're doing. How much time is it going to buy you? Uh, I'm going to find out because this is really the first time I've ever done this. But, I mean, it's going to save my buddy 800 bucks um, if it gets him a year, if it gets him two years. I mean, it may get him a long time. I mean, he obviously needs to take care of his battery over here, but... 
um, I think that's uh, that's a good fix. And I want to do I'm going to do it right here at the tip them because then I don't have to run a wire all along the bottom of the uh, the radiator. You know, all this wire is like if you I already took the tip them apart and looked inside of there and thought maybe I could solder something inside the tip them to fix these drivers, but I can't. So I put everything back together. And basically I'm going to do, since my two wires are right here, I'm going to, you know, if you were going to unplug all these, you would unplug them as one bunch because you can see they're all tied together. So I'm just going to cut, cut. I'm not going to cut the wires in half. I'm going to piggyback splice on the back. And I'm just going to run me a jumper that's going to come off and it's going to come right over here. These, like I said, are just my test leads. Kind of just to make sure I was on the right wires. But basically, like I said, I'm just going to take a wire and I'm going to splice them right into there. And then I'm going to tape it all up. So, um, like I said, you can find uh, a wiring diagram online. Um, like I said, you're looking for the low side headlight drivers. And, um, you know, if you can get a good look in here at these. If you got an 06 ramp or any 06 probably, you're, these are going to be pretty much the same. They might be a little different, but I got the uh, Dodge wiring diagrams, and that's basically what the... Uh, the wire color showed so white with tan white with blue both low side drivers so um it was kind of a quick video i kind of you know I, i'm not going to splice them in right now just because that'll take too long but um if you guys have any questions or comments go ahead and leave me a, or if you got a question leave me a comment and i'll try and get back to you if there's anything i can help you with this is a a great fix for these rams you know i'm i'm, I'm pretty happy with it i'm excited to kind of see how long this lasts i think you know 800 bucks taking a couple a little bit of time i mean i only worked on this probably an hour and i'm going to have probably another 20 minutes in it if that splice this wire together just because i'm going to make sure it looks nice and then i'm going to have to go get him another bulb since he's got a bad bulb and we'll be set to go like i said if you got any questions leave a comment and uh thanks for watching